Okay, just a little farther. Wow, someone really went bonkers with the defenses, huh? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Oh, who goes there? Oh, Jesse, is that you? Lucas, did you build all of this? Well, yeah. I, I figured I would try and fortify the place, you know? Nice. I'm so glad you're back. And we brought Magnus. Fantastic. Quick, come on. You guys are never going to believe who showed up while you were gone. Gabriel! Hello, everyone. It is good to see you. He showed up not too long before you guys. Magnus, my old you friend. You always were a tough cookie to keep down. <laughs> it's good to see you. It's good to see you, too. You'll meet it. And it's especially good to see you, Jesse. I fear that you might be the last face I ever saw. It's such a relief to see you. I'm glad you're okay. If you hadn't pulled me out of the Witherstorm's clutches, well, let's just not think about that. I came here to the temple, hoping against hope to find other survivors. It makes me glad that even in these terrible times, this temple can stand as a stronghold. A symbol. Did anyone else get away? Were there any other survivors? All that creature left in its wake was bedrock. All those people. Your friend Petra. No one could get away. We are alive. That means there's still hope. Everyone else is still inside. Wow! Been a while since I've been here. Whoa. What is she doing here? Oh, this isn't going to go well. Right. Um, I forgot to mention, Olivia went on a little expedition of her own while you were gone. And this... Olivia person came back with her? Did you know about this? Did Eligard put you up to this? You think you know a guy, and then, bam. Olivia's a friend of mine. I didn't know that she was going off to recruit Eligard. Magnus, you gotta believe me. Well, I certainly don't have anything to say to her. Jesse, Jesse, look, I found Eligard. Just hang on a sec, okay? I'll go figure out what's going on. Good. You do that. Easy now, Olivia. Let's try and play it cool. Hmm? So, who are you now? And why did you bring him with you? Yeah, and you two are going to have to get along, okay? We didn't even know you were going to be here. If he's nice, I'll be nice too. It was kind of crazy, actually. I went to Redstonia, and there were all these incredible engineers and inventors. It was a little intimidating, actually, but Eligard's made me her protege. Well, assistant for now. I mean, after what happened. I know, I'm sorry. So sorry. Well, I'm the king of Boomtown. Very impressive. She might have, well, embarrassed herself. A tiny bit. Yeah. But after I pled my case, she agreed to take me on as her assistant and come back to help. Not bad, right? Oh, hooray! It's Ellie. And here I was just starting to enjoy myself. Hello, Magnus. Your voice is exactly as pleasant as I remember. Which is to say, not at all. Oh, my feelings. Is that the same wit you're going to use to save the world? Why? You're here to tell me how to do it better? Oh, I would never dream of doing that. Unlike you, I actually do things instead of just talking about them. Hey, that's Eligard you're talking to. Show her some respect. Wow, you finally found yourself a live one. Hey, 
Your little devotees are usually a little more on the bookish side. Olivia, I just stay out of this. But your friend's right, Olivia. I've got this just fine on my own. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry Witherstorm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. Yeah, I'll admit, that thing looked real nasty. And I've seen some nasty stuff in my time. Too much for you, was it? Your usual brutish approach didn't cut it? Hey, you weren't there, all right? You didn't see how this thing just tore everything up. Would you two stop fighting? Whoa! Yikes. Jesse speaks the truth. We must find a way to defeat that monstrosity. I don't know if you've looked around yet, but this place isn't nearly the stronghold it used to be. Most of our supplies are gone. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. Are they getting along? You're members of the Order. You two can't handle this? Whoa. Give us a minute, all right? We just barely got here. We'll get it. But even if we had all the TNT for miles around, I don't know if it would be enough. If only Soren were here, he might have something we could use. Oh, Ellie. Not this again. Wait, Magnus. She may have a point. Soren did have certain objects, inventions. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. I think I've got a legitimate idea here. What are you talking about? What did Soren have? Soren had a kind of super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formida Bomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F-Bomb before. F-Bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F-Bomb could destroy anything. Well, the Formida Bomb sounds perfect. We should go get it now. Well, there's a little problem there. We don't know where Soren is, but you found Magnus and Eligard. Do you know where he is? Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the Nether, or the End. But it's worth a shot. That we can find him. Hey, Magnus. Hey, small fry. No shame in admitting you can't turn that thing on. It's very, very sophisticated. I'm going, I'm going. I know what I'm... Hey, Gabriel. Well, go on, Jesse. Show them what you can do. Hello, Eligard. You said you know how to activate the map? I'm very curious to see it. I've never actually seen it work before. Hey, Axel, how are you doing? I'm hanging out with Magnus. I'm doing awesome. Glad to hear it, buddy. How are you holding up, Lucas? I'm all right. This has all been pretty intense. I feel like if I think too much about what's been going on... Thank you so much for all the help. I, I know we haven't always gotten along the best in the past, but you've been so great. Wow. That means a lot, Jesse. Thank you. My light. That's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order broke up, that's where he went to keep doing his experiments. Look, he invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. Glad we can agree on that, 
At any rate. Then let's stop hanging around here and go get us some super tea. Whoa. It didn't do that before. Are you sure it's working? Blue? Blue? That's Ivor! Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move! It's not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Perfect. We can wait till tomorrow morning and travel with a full day's sunlight. Uh, and risk that thing catching up with us? I think I've had enough wither storm for one day. Ah, uh, thank you very much. Right, because getting caught out there in the dark is so much better. Trust me, if you had seen this thing, you wouldn't want to stick around. Yeah, I don't want the wither storm catching up with us. We should go now. Jesse here is talking a lot of sense. Let's just go with that plan. You're just saying that because it's your plan, but fine. Okay, everyone, let's get moving. Jesse, right? Oh, hello. We haven't had the chance to acquaint ourselves properly. According to Gabriel, you saved him from this wither storm. Sounds like you're a pretty impressive individual. Picks fights with lots of monsters? Always defending the weak and defenseless? I'm just doing my best to keep everyone safe. I can always appreciate humility. I like you. In any case, I sort of wish that you had taken my side earlier, but water under the bridge and all that. A slight tangent, what's the uh, deal with your friend Olivia? I appreciate her enthusiasm, but she can be a little much sometimes. She's always very eager to jump in and help, which is sweet, of course, though sometimes I wish she would think a bit more before jumping in. She can be kind of a know-it-all sometimes. Uh, I suppose I could see that. Though I've mostly just gotten her, uh, sucking up side. Would you say that's why you didn't listen to her plan to come recruit me? Not to make it awkward or anything. Or to demand, why didn't you want to recruit me? <laughs> just curiosity. I don't know, I just wanted to go with Axel instead, I guess. Hmm, that's fair, I suppose. I'll do my best to not let it hurt my feelings joke. That was a joke. Yep, exactly what I worried about, and exactly why we should have waited till morning. At least the wither storm isn't tearing us apart right now, all right? We can hash all that out later, because we got some monsters to fight here, people. Daytime. How far is Soren? It can't be much further. Not much farther. We can make it. Look! 
and thought I would come down to help. <laughs> Enderman. There are so many. I didn't think they ever came in groups that big. Thanks for coming back, Lucas. I mean that. away. That's it. I'm going. See? I'm walking away too now. Super TNT. Here I come. It's hard to pick glass half full when they keep kicking the glass over. And I thought they were doing so well. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. Bickering is kind of their deal. But hopefully they'll work things out and get on with the important stuff. What are we going to do now? Where should we go? Let's figure it out. Hey, Gabriel. Hello, Jesse. You okay? a statue of me, I wouldn't choose that pose. I'd look like this. This place is a dream come true for Lucas. Look at him. He's loving it. Gabriel, are you okay? I know it's not the best time, and I, I don't want to worry you, but there's something I'd like to discuss with you in private, Jesse. Well, let's split up. That letting them head off alone was risky, but I need to talk to you about a private matter. It's not the easiest thing to bring up. Hey, whatever it is, I trust you. You can tell me. Thank you for being so understanding. I'm so glad to see my old friends together again. I don't want to ruin it with this. What? You may have succeeded in getting me away from the Wither Storm, but I fear it was already too late. I noticed it not long after you saved me. 
Holy crap, what are we doing down here? We need to get you help. Tragically, I'm not sure there's anything that can help with this, Jesse. Tell me, do you know what Wither is? The Wither? Of course, we've been... No, just Wither. Or Wither's sickness, to be more descriptive. It is something I've contracted before in my travels, but it always wears off. It seems that Ivor's monster exudes a Wither's sickness that is decidedly more... fatal. Well, we're going to go back and tell the others we can get help. No, Jesse. You can't tell anyone about this. Uh Creeper, look out! Take my hand. I'll pull you up. My strength is compromised. I couldn't maintain my hold. I'm so sorry. Jesse, are you all right? Are you hurt? Jesse! Hey, you're the one that's sick. Take care of yourself first. I'll be okay. Time to be a hero again. Stay safe. I'll find a way down to you. He has to! Why would he have so many books? Hey, show yourself! Who's there? <gasps> you! Trying to interfere with my plans again, I see. Your tenacity is commendable, yet misguided! You found your way in here? So now you may find it back out again. Ivor, just calm down, okay? I think we're here for the same reason. I'm here with the order to find Soren's Super TNT. We're going to take down your Witherstorm. The Order? <laughs> Believe me, that plan will blow up in their faces in more ways than one. They cannot help you. But me? I choose not to. Out of my way. Move! Wait, but I... Stop right there, Ivor! <laughs> Gabriel! You're alive! Against all your best efforts, Ivor. Look at what you've done that even you could be this twisted. Save your posturing, Gabriel. We both know your words have always been hollow, just like the Order. They're not going anywhere, Amor. At least not in one piece. The threats pass harmlessly to me. You should let the Order decide. They'll know what to do. I the Order a lot longer than you, Jesse. I believe they would be alive. Who can stop the Witherstorm? Not you, not the Order! 
Don't make yourselves the villains in my story. Stay and fight, you coward! This could have all been avoided. If you want to stop me, you'll have to catch me first. Look out! He's using a potion of swiftness. We mustn't let him escape. <laughs> I'm like the wind. I'll go through you if I have to. Don't tempt your fate. It didn't have to go this way, Jesse. You could have just let me go. <laughs> now you see me. Now you. <laughs> He could be anywhere. Stay in your guard. Invisible or not, he isn't going to get by me. <laughs> Please, I just stand down. This one's on you, you puffed up fool. There's no time for this. Jesse! Gabriel! Even more of you? Will this parade of useless babblers never cease? What's going on? You found Ivor. You stopped him. <laughs> False. You have stopped nothing. The query. Have you ever seen the effects of a splash potion of slowness? That they can destroy the Wither Storm, but they are mistaken, and it will cost them their lives. Next time on Minecraft Story Mode. In pursuit of answers, all our heroes found in Sauron's armory was deceit and treachery. Locked in a dark chamber deep in Sauron's mountain, as the Order of the Stone rides off towards near certain doom, our heroes must ask themselves, would they find a way out of this dark tomb? Is there any way to cure Gabriel's wither sickness? Would they find a way to defeat the wither storm? Or will they remain trapped as it continues its ravenous rampage across the entire world? Only time will tell. Sports car just to prove I'm a real big baller cause I'm